Welcome to the um, welcome to Pulse uh, Impulse Gear. All right, what in the world? Select if you are left or right-handed. Oh my gosh! What a nice blue environment. What a nice blue environment. I'm going right-handed. Adjust the height to match how tall you are. How tall am I? I would say that measurement. Adjust the height to match how tall you are. I would say five foot eight. The following steps will confirm that you are positioned. Is that my actual camera? What? Represents the tracking area of the I just got on. The place so just wait. Tracks the VR headset and DualShock 4 wireless controller. To play Farpoint, you must be within the tracking area. If the controller or the VR headset go outside of the tracking area, they cannot be tracked. If you get near the edge or the tracking is lost, this shape will appear in game to guide you back into position. To confirm tracking, touch each segment with your controller. Far point. It's the game that she can't you see. the see. location of the camera and the tracking area while playing the game, hold the options button. Setup complete. Thank you. Oh, you're welcome, I guess. So yeah, this is the farthest point in history. Far point. Project Nurses. Connecting to live stream. No way this thing connects to my live stream. Hello, planet Earth. I'm Eva Tyson, one of the 230 scientists and engineers stationed up here on the Pilgrim. Regular viewers of this live feed will notice I am not in my traditional t-shirt and socks. I am in a spacesuit. And that is because today I am going home. And joining me on that homeward flight is one of my colleagues, Dr. Grant Moon. Hi. It's Hi. It's pretty incredible because we've both been aboard the Pilgrim for three months. But because there are so many people up here studying the anomaly, this is actually the first time that Dr. Tyson and I have met. So, hello, Dr. Tyson. Oh, hello, Dr. Moon. <laughs> I, thought, I thought this would detect, or I'm I thought sure this would actually saying, connect to my actual live stream. Branch that applies the laws of physics and chemistry to analyze the genesis and demise of various nebulae in the universe. Observable objects, atomic particles, all the way up. Pretty much anything on the candela and thermodynamic temperature scales. It includes aspects of astronomy and cosmology as well, but it's actually more complex than that, so... He's a star expert. <laughs> yeah, you know, using that would save a lot of space on my resume. <laughs> it really would. And for those of you who are new to this, our ship is here to analyze a very special wave of radiation. We're all here just for that. Now, the universe is full of solar radiation, but what makes this radiation so special is that it has no discernible source. Masses of energy... It's getting closer. ...the universe from nowhere. So you can see why we're all so fascinated by it. Limitless energy. Forever. Now, if we look out the window... You should be able to see the shuttle that's coming to pick us up. The Wanderer. Named after the poem. The Wanderer returns. And if we link to the pilot's POV camera, you'll get a good view of the entire... It's gonna explode, system. watch. It's gonna explode. Anomaly behind us. I have a feeling. And if we're lucky, we should just be able to see the Big Dipper off to the side, too. Here we go. Watch, it's gonna explode. What in the world? Yes! What in the world? What in the world? Oh my god! I'm on a spaceship! Sus. It's a galaxy! Sus. We're ready for you in the airlock. Please activate your auto docking sequence. Oh crap. Roger right that, Pilgrim. This is Wanderer. Auto docking sequence engaged. Thank you, Wanderer. You're looking good. Uh, Wanderer, we're having some difficulty syncing with your docking gear. Your guidance system will take care of your side, but I think we're gonna need a second over here. 
Okay, let me turn on the sensors. Roger that, Pilgrim, waiting on you. Who needs a charger? Keep it coming. What happened? Wait, wait. I think it's still not working. We're gonna try a manual reboot. Stand by. I'm gonna crash in! Still nothing. Command, any different on your end? This is command. Now we got the same reading here. No sync. We need an engineer to go out and fix the docking mechanism. No, no, it's not a big deal. Wanderer, we're in our EMU suits. We can just open the airlock manually and boost over to you. Dr. Tyson, I'd rather do this by the book. This is yeah, do it by the book. Look, we tether to the Pilgrim, boost over to the shuttle, reattach there, release the first tether. It's a simple one. Don't want to hold on. If we wait to schedule an engineer, we'll be stranded here another week, and the Wanderer will be stuck waiting right there. Okay, oh what the heck is this? That is not a useful question here. Well, there are people I want to get home to. So. <sighs> Command, does this sit right with you? Tethered walk is okay with us, Dr. Moon. Your call. Okay. Wanderer, please maintain your position and prepare for manual boarding. I guess we're taking a walk. Roger, holding position. All right, I'm holding my position. Okay, I'm opening the outer hatch. Tethers are attached. Looking good. So your name? It's uh, seriously Doctor Moon. Yeah, but for all the play. Doctor Moon and Doctor Tyson. <laughs> Get out of there! What the hell is that? Pilgrim, this is Eva. Are you seeing this? Plus five. Six on. It's gonna blow! Oh my god. Pilgrim, do you copy? Do you see this? We gotta move. What is it doing? We gotta move now. One Crap! It's a supernova. No, it's a black hole. It's a black hole. Get out of there. I can't. Drive. Okay, now we're in little poo. I guess we're oh, right now not in crap. Crash landed. But we're gonna hold on. Uh... Okay, we're impact. I died, didn't I? Yeah, I died. <sighs> Cass, location report now. Mission <laughs> unknown. Analyzing atmospheric composition. 23% nitrogen, 2% oxygen, 12% helium. Warning, 63% unknown elements. Um, no, don't open. What the heck? 
Oh gosh. Yes! Pilgrim, this is Wander. Come back. I say again, this is Wander Actual. Pilgrim, do you copy? It's 10 40. This was the cause of the destruction of the star, I believe. Space ship. This is why I don't use controller. Supposed to like climb up there. Oh, crap! Am I supposed to go? Oh, yeah, that through here. Oh, yeah. This is why I. Rifle for UEP personnel. It provides a high rate of fire and unlimited ammo, but can overheat. Keep an eye on the 
integrated heat gauge. Dr. Moon, Dr. Tyson, this is Wanderer. Do you copy? This is really cool though, I like the space theme. Yeah, for sure that way. What in the world? What if we just fall for here? Uh, probably die. I don't risk it. That's a pretty nice gun. It's like Call of Duty, but for the hour. Alive. Dr. Moon, Dr. Tyson, if you can hear this, stay where you are. I'll find you. Skin not found. That volcano looks like it's about to erupt. Hello? Is someone there? Let's identify this geode. Yeah, that's just a geode. 
Um, I don't have, uh, I currently don't have, um, I'm currently in the story mode, so I will have to take me a minute, just give me a minute, I'm currently inside of the story mode, the main mode. Um, I'm not going to leave just yet, I'm going to wait to my saving point. But I will be glad to play with you sometime soon. What the- Had crabs. They were in a- Hey look, it's the spiders. Alright, oh, what are these things? Okay, looks like I can. Oh god! Oh god! Stay back! They went this far. So those things are apparently the eggs. I don't know what's happening. Are those like the eggs or whatever? All fragments. What the? Okay, we're getting closer. I say again, Pilgrim! Pilgrim, can you read me? This is Dr. Tyson and Dr. Moon. Come back! The signal needs more power. Even without the dust storm. I'm getting a low-level reading over in that direction. Over there. Could be another survivor. How far? 
crap. I think they fell off this cliff. Oh. Oh, no, this way. You go this way. Not shoot these things. Gas. Make sure you're logged on this. This is pretty. I like this. This is very cool and pretty. Very nice. People. I guess it looks like I head this way. this thing. Ugh! Do I die? No, no, I didn't. I never died. I didn't. Oh. Oh my, no, no, no. Oh. 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 Well, there goes me. 
Eleven oh one. Ugh. Thing who's that guy up ahead? Whatever this is. Partial data recovery complete. New holographic files are available to view. Playback. All recovered files. We found a power source. Hello? Anyone inside? Come on. It's the space station that they were at. Our signal. You prep them. I'll patch into the comms unit. Well, yours, Dr. Moon. Oh, sorry. Oh, here you go. Percent is enough for six months. Everyone on that yeah, ship is a crewmate. Yeah, you but. On <laughs> Hello? <laughs> Probably a shit ton of EMR out here. Tseh! <laughs> yeah! <laughs> keep trying. Survivors keep moving. And Among Us, I know what the imposter planet looks like. It looks like a big smug cloud. But all they're doing is just trying to figure out where they're going. Pilgrim. Pilgrim, this is Dr. Tyson and Dr. Moon. Come back. Pilgrim, if you can read us, we don't know our location. We're down to our last emergency rations, but we found a HAB unit. There are extra rations here to keep us going. 
we're alive. Are you? Please come back. Either. But you have to take a break. I'm going for an hour. What? Here. It's the last month of my suit. Some kind of strawberry goo. Ugh. When the pilgrim broke up on entry, it left a trail of debris just like this, right? We found one piece because we're sitting in it. But if we can find the next few pieces, we can calculate the speed and trajectory of the station. Yes! You sure about this? Not very, but it's all we got. I'm gonna follow the trail of debris. You keep trying the radio. Make sure you keep this door locked. Are we expecting company? Okay. Oh, we know who's gonna die. She is going to die. I have a feeling. Oh. Okay, Eva. I'm right behind you. Dr. Tyson, if you can hear this, I'm following the trail of debris. God, alien being! I hope we can actually see Dr. Tyson once again. Yeah. Him very good. Die! Die, alien creature! That was what, that's, that's what, that's what we was, was being held. Suit status. Highlighted button. To pick up the weapon, move close and press the highlighted button. 
Shotgun. The UEP tactical shotgun provides maximum stopping power at close range. It features semi-automatic fire with a seven round capacity and an integrated grenade launcher. Grenade! How much bigger do these things get? Exactly, how do these things get bigger? What's that? I died again. Not again. Grenade launcher. The UEP tactical shotgun has an integrated grenade launcher. The high explosive grenades explode three seconds after being fired or instantly if they hit an enemy. The UEP tactical shotgun can hold a total of 10 grenades. Yeah, I'll get off here in a second. I just want to save. Just one shot at me. Oh yeah, I think it saved. I don't know if that saved or not. Got it.
Ugh. Oh, you're an ugly beast. I'm just gonna save here. Tip the shotgun is most effective at close range. I know, I know. <gasps> oh, so you can actually play co-op. All right, we'll do the co-op thing next time. Um, right now I just gotta get off. I'll see you all in the next stream. Goodbye. Pretty fun stream.